video is in response to Elite Skater 08 hardline stance against Nike SB. I 100% agree with him, the fact that Nike needs to keep its scrubby nose out of skateboarding. They are undoubtedly one of the biggest contributors to the demise of S, the near bankruptcy, scare of DBS, and so on. It's easy for mega corporations to slap together glamorous looking skateboard teams that whet the appetites of today's top pros. And in essence, um, eliminate the competition. I certainly don't begrudge the pros of their paychecks, but for such pros to sell out to the enemy like that is a slap in the face to the smaller companies that really promote skateboarding, help get skate parts built, and overall support skaters in even small ways. When has Nike been there for skateboarding when it was struggling to get to become the great sport that it is today? When has Nike become has has helped build skate parks. Even if they had, it, it very well could have been for the wrong motive. Well, neither will it be there for us should trouble strike again. And just as Elite Skater 08 says, Nike SBs totally lack soul, and they're just copycat cookie cutters of real skate shoes. And even their logo, I feel, is lame. The same old Nike check mark that's been around for the past, I don't know, 50 years just with SB stamped beside it. Now, would I, would I begrudge any small new company just jumping into building skate shoes just for the sake of making money and honest living? No. Provided that, of course, their goal is to promote and just be there for skateboarding and skateboarders in general, through thick and thin. Besides, smaller companies and even smaller um, corporations, they don't have the clout or the power, like, Nike SB, Adidas, or whatever, to put the hurting on the skate industry, strip away skateboarding's unique and unique heritage, only to abandon and leave us to die if the chips are down. This photo, which I found somewhere online, succinctly sums up my case. The only other ones to benefit in such a case would be the pros, since they're paid, they're being paid, though the rest of the sport and the industry are suffering. No! true hardcore skateboarder ambassadors we are in this together and if one suffers we all rally around and suffer with it money is not everything these pros that ride for nike ought to know better which is why i'm sorry to say i have a tough time respecting them well we well add to it the fact that though plenty of skaters may wear nike so do a lot of non-skaters according to another um youtuber they say they um, and plus I've been told a lot of bikers wear them as well. In my opinion, all that makes our pros look awful silly. Um, endorsing Nike SB. Well, we don't want to be swallowed up with everyone else, and we skaters traditionally function as territorial animals, and for good reason. We're proud of and protective of our sport and the heritage thereof. Nike SB is nothing more than a Trojan horse a wolf in sheep's clothing uttered into the skate scene as legit, nonetheless is ready to rob skateboarding of its unique flavor and identity by, you know, shutting down all the other competition. It behooves us all, especially serious skaters, to only support companies that support us. I don't care how comfortable the shoes may be. I don't care if there are a few pennies cheaper, which I doubt anyways. Furthermore, for the countless other skaters out there, which I've spoken to about S, believe it or not, something can be done. A few skate shops I've recently spoken to say it could potentially make a comeback. I propose and ask that as many of you S skaters or S fans out there, as many as possible, go to soultechnology.com and write and tell them how much S means to you and to skateboarding and how much you'd love to have them back. Let's unite and chase Nike SB up the road with a stick and drive home the point to these pros that money is not what dictates the future and the destiny of our beloved sport.